Officials in Flint, Michigan now say test results show more lead in the water of some homes than filters can handle. It's the latest issue in the ongoing water crisis the city is facing. Here in town, a local group has returned from doing their part in helping out. NBC 15's Jalisa Irizarry sat down with a volunteer who delivered water from Madison to Flint earlier this week. Hey, Tim, thanks, man. Michael Johnson is no stranger to service. How many waters you need, sir? So it was no surprise when the CEO of the Dane County Boys and Girls Club felt inspired to give back to the thousands in need less than 500 miles away. I felt like our community was obligated to do something, and our community did. With some help from the community, Johnson and his team loaded up 30,000 gallons of bottled water for the people of Flint, Michigan, earlier this week. The community leader has been following the news closely, but he says seeing it for his own eyes was a completely different experience. It felt like we were in a third world country. This is a guy named uh, Anthony Thomas. Him and his brother had been walking two miles every single day for water two miles every day for water. How does that happen? Stories Johnson says were difficult to hear throughout the trip. To hear another young, young lady talk about how she couldn't uh, feed her dogs that contaminated water. My, my pit has got skin coming off his back. This makes you angry. Messages that resonated with the group. I got to tell you, people cried when we knocked on their doors. They hugged us. They embraced us. They were so thankful. And is inspiring them to do more. Well, even though I felt like we did something great from this community, I feel like we could have did more. Those folks need us. We have a moral obligation uh, to help those young people, their families. In Madison, Jalisa Rosari, NBC 15 News. Johnson said he is planning on taking another trip back to Flint. He was also able to raise some money and give some funds for the local Boys and Girls Clubs there.